and welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabby if you haven't met me before. Um, I am doing this new series where I do five minute book reviews because your girl can talk a lot. So without ranting too much, let's get into it. Today I'm talking about Birthday Girl by Penelope Douglas. I am obsessed with this book so much. Okay, if you're my mom, or my grandma or someone please do not read this book it's steamy but you know what it's freaking good okay this book birthday girl by penelope douglas is kind of like a giant age gap forced proximity sort of books i feel like some people might consider it problematic because of the relationship that occurs in this book which i will get into it after my little rant right here um but i feel like the way that it happens and everything i was okay with because i was i have owned this book for so long and it took me forever to actually read it because i was kind of scared about what was going to occur in this book because of some of the things that i had heard but you know what it was so good and so worth the read and I am sold on Penelope Douglas and up here it's hidden up there behind Majesty um I got Punk 57 I think it's Punk 57 um by Penelope Douglas and I plan on reading that and I'm also ordered I also ordered Credence and there's a couple other ones that I'm going to be ordering as well that are new that's coming out uh so I'm very excited about this so I'll jump into this um Birthday Girl is a story about Jordan and Pike, and it rotates, it alternates between both of their views of the story, so each chapter is a different character speaking. Um, Jordan is dating this guy, what is his name? I keep wanting to say Cole. Let's see, oh yeah, his name is Cole. Okay, so Jordan's dating this boy named Cole, and they've been dating, I think, probably since high school or whatever, but she was in a really bad abusive relationship and then she started dating Cole and something happened where he had like lost his job or lost his motivation and so she started working and has taken over basically everything taking over the bills and they were living in an apartment together and she was trying to help fix him I guess and he's trying to fix himself but not trying hard enough and so we start off the story with her birthday it's her birthday and um her boyfriend was supposed to pick her up from work but she ended up getting off early so she goes to the movie theater to watch this old film and ends up meeting this gentleman who she's attracted to but obviously she thinks that, she, that he's older than her and um she's in a relationship so she she just notices that attraction but she's not gonna act on it at all so then at the end of this um we find out spoiler it's not really a spoiler because that's the premise of the story uh we find out that pike when when she learns his name uh that pike is the father of her boyfriend and she was attracted to her boyfriend's father <laughs> and that's where the problematic stuff comes in but Long story short, it's already been freaking five minutes of me talking and trying to explain this. Oops. Um, Cole does something crappy where they get kicked out of their apartment. He throws a party for her and it gets too wild and they get kicked out of their apartment. And so they have to move in with Pike because it's the only option for them. So they move in with Pike and force proximity. She ends up developing feelings for Pike things happen with her and Cole where he does something crappy and then the story develops around her relationship with Pike and it's adorable I really freaking like it and it's something that was different very different not something that I'm used to it's not something I would normally read but it was so worth it so exciting to me and I really really enjoyed it so 10 out of 10 would recommend it's steamy it's a little smutty and it's freaking hot and i love it i've read this twice because it's just the best the the relationship is like adorable to me 
so <laughs> uh, without continuing a rant birthday girl read it if you've thought about it pick it up and read it it's amazing like this book is just like it feels nice it feels nice it's smooth it's slick it's one of those books that just feels nice and when you read it it's nice as well <laughs> that's all i'm gonna say i hope you have a great rest of your day thank you for watching and i hope you enjoyed the video uh have a great weekend and don't forget to like subscribe all that jazz. All right, I love you. Have a great weekend. Bye.